Good morning children. Welcome in SST class. Children, today we are going to do map work. Uh, I'm not telling you the topic. You just guess. I'm talking about the green lungs of the planet. Precious natural resource. Green lungs of the planet. Yes, absolutely right. I'm talking about forest. So today we'll do the map work uh, and the topic is different kinds of forest. You know that our country is blessed with a wide variety of forest but we have a limited area of land under forest. Okay, because of different climatic conditions. Different, different types of forest are here in India. So we'll do four important types of forest. Number one, coniferous, that is also called mountain forest. Number two, thorn forest. Number three, deciduous or monsoon forest. Number four, evergreen or tropical forest. Okay, children. Children, get it ready with your map physical map of India and uh, pencil and sketch colors. Okay, children? So, children, this is the physical map of India and uh, we are going to show different kinds of forest. Okay? So, at first, we'll write the heading different kinds of forest. Write down the heading. Right? Different kinds of forests. Children, at first we will show mountain forest or coniferous forest. Okay? We know that these forests are found mostly along the slopes of Himalayan mountains. Slopes of Himalayan mountains. Okay? We are showing here coniferous forest. Okay? You just see the shape I am showing in this way. Okay, and here also neck of Jammu Kashmir, Jammu and Kashmir, here and here. Okay, and here also means along the slopes of Himalayan mountains. Here also in Sikkim. Okay, right. So, these are coniferous forests or you can say mountain forests. Okay, children. So, now in index also for this we will use brown color, right? So, here by using brown color you will make the shape of coniferous. Uh, we are indicating by this only, okay? So, you have to write coniferous forest. So, clear? So, we will use color here also. Okay. And so, it is clear. So, clear. So, these are coniferous forests or mountain forests and these forests are found mostly along the slopes of Himalayan mountains. So, clear. Here also in index we have shown, right, coniferous forest. Or number two, we will show evergreen forest. And you know that evergreen forest are found mostly in hot and wet regions. Hot and wet regions, these forests are found along the rainy slopes of the western ghats. Rainy slopes of the western ghats. So, here we'll show evergreen forests. Okay, children? Okay, so this is clear. Rainy slopes of the western ghats and in the hills of northeastern India. Here also. Okay. You will make the shape of 
evergreen forest right so it is clear and here also an index we'll use green color for these forests okay right okay here also we are using dark green color and also in index we'll use same color and we'll write here evergreen forest so it is clear at first you have to use pencil because if any correction is required you can erase that then after you have to use sketch color right next is number 3 i am talking about thorn forest thorn forest are found mostly in dry areas where the average annual rainfall is less than 50 cm okay these forests are mostly found in rajasthan and gujarat and uh, some parts of haryana also okay uh, the trees are short and have long roots okay children means we'll show here and i'm using it for pencil okay and here also we'll show thorn forest you can see you can see in this way right so it is clear so these are thorn forest are found mostly in the dry areas where the average rainfall is less than 50 cm okay and i'm telling you about uh, about uh, these forests we can also find in the interior parts of the peninsula interior part of the peninsula or you can say rain shadow areas of the dakkan plateau rain shadow areas of the dakkan plateau here maharashtra karnataka andhra pradesh in these areas okay so here you will see so it is clear you can show here few parts of means interior parts of peninsula so we'll use black color for indicating thorn forest right so you have to use black color for indicating thorn forest and uh, in index also you will show by using black color okay right here also interior part of the peninsula so it is clear you can see and in index also we'll show by using black color and we'll write here thorn forest okay right now the last one is i'm using red color for that deciduous forest okay deciduous forest and you know that a major part of our country is under deciduous or you can say monsoon forest okay children so deciduous forests are also found also called monsoon forest and uh, these are mostly found along the foothills of the himalayas okay here oh sorry foothills of the himalayas okay and here also maximum part hamara country ka ye wale forest cover karte hain okay uh, means a major part of our country is under 
deciduous forest okay so here right so here also few parts of gujarat right and you just see the location where i'm showing right okay you just see so this is all about the forest and we'll indicate here deciduous forest by using red color and we'll write here deciduous forest so this is the index so i'm telling you again you have to take care while preparing while making uh, index you have to take care of spellings you have to write the heading also okay and you have to show different kinds of forest in this way okay children that's all about you have to do maximum practice aap jitna practice karenge definitely you will get good marks for map work okay okay children bye bye